Come on, bras. Come at me. Got a little surprise for you. I'm going to show you a new meaning of what it means when you hear Shark Week. Welcome back, everybody, to Ark Survival Ascendant. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we are going to get eaten by our own Mosasaur. <laughs> uh, we are going to take our ocean army here and finally go do the Eastern Sea Cave legit. So uh, I need more artifact of the cunning. Um, so that's the main reason why we're going in there. But um, I, I want to actually do the cave, actually do the cave all the way through Anyway, and so I figured let's go ahead and give it a try. So we've got um, a 12 shark crew here. Um, well, I don't know. Do we have 12? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I don't know. <laughs> I, I've lost a couple of sharks. Um, so, yeah, we, we got some sharks here. Um, plus we have both of our... Um, our uh, Basilosaurs, and we're also going to take Masarita uh, with us because I'm finished with her for breeding. Um, so, uh, but she's, um, I think she was like 85 or something when we tamed her in the wild. And she's got decent stats. I've, I've been leveling her, so she has 25,000 health and 462 melee. It's not absolutely fantastic, but, um, you know, I think she'll definitely help us uh, in there. But of course, I'm going to be riding on the Basilosaur. Uh, so we don't get dismounted by jellyfish. Okay, so, um, yeah, I don't think I have, actually have 12 sharks. I think I had 12 sharks at one point, but I lost, um, a, two sharks, or one shark to the mesh anyways, trying to get them back out of the Western Sea Cave. So we have whatever we have. <laughs> um, and hopefully it'll be enough. So... Uh, I have obviously been in the Eastern Sea Cave to get the Artifact of the Cunning, but I kind of ninja it out of there. I didn't actually go in and take the cave on, uh, which is what we're going to do now. So uh, let's go ahead and head on over there and we'll see what happens. Now, this cave is supposed to be harder, uh, and it definitely was harder than the Western Sea Cave in Survival Evolved. Um... So I don't know if that's also going to be the case here now in Ascended or not, because I haven't been throughout the entire cave. I've just been, you know, through the first part of it in order to get the artifact. And you know what else? Uh, man, I should probably, I should be, I should bring an otter with me. Damn it, Jim. All right, I'm going to teleport back really quick and get an otter. I'll be right back. Okay, so we are in front of the cave here. Um, I noticed that some of my Sharky Poos have some levels. Um, or was it Ghost? No. Uh, so let's get the give them some levels. They're mostly leveled up. Um, this one actually is a new shark, so it's not completely leveled up. Because I had to replace one that I lost to the mesh. Um, everybody else, though, should be 15,000 health and... You know, pushing 800 uh, damage. Um, so let's just double check everybody really quick. And I do actually have 12 sharks to account to them. Um, so this is a pretty formidable force that we're bringing in here. Uh, definitely a much larger force than we have attempted to date in the West Sea Cave. Uh, and the nice thing about the East Sea Cave is there's a little more room to, uh, you know, to maneuver in there too. Oh my goodness! Here, I'm gonna actually. I guess I could have this guy kill a, a normal, um, uh, whatchamacallit, Tuso, on the way over here, as I recall. Okay, and you got a point. And you have a point. You have five points. So you must have, yeah, you killed an alpha. All right, I'll take that. I think I'm just going to leave the rest of that stuff in your inventory for now. And then uh, we already looked at... Mosarita there. Okay. <clears throat> so, you know, even though we do have a sizable force here, um, I am still going to be cautious. I'm not going to take this cave for granted. 
So when we get to the first area, you know, where we're going to have enemies, we're going to kind of stay back and try and pull them to us and hopefully not pull, like, you know, the entire room of them. At least that's the plan. Of course, that was kind of our plan in the West Sea Cave last time we did it, and we still pulled the entire damn room. So we'll see how it goes here. Like I said, every time I've come in here so far, I've just kind of really moved by the first set of enemies quickly, so I haven't really stopped to look to see exactly how many of them there are. Um, and I also want to make sure we're not losing anybody uh, behind, uh, around these corners. Uh, it looks like maybe... Oh, there's the Mosa right there. Okay. I think everybody's with us. Um, I could... I guess I could track these guys, but you can only have a maximum of 12 tracked, and so we wouldn't be able to track the entire army. But yeah, it looks like everybody's here, so... Okay, and I'm stuck, so everybody move away from me, and then follow me again. Okay, so I think as we come into this next spot here where it starts to lighten up a little bit we have our first set of enemies and I see a bunch of donkeys and some sharks and yeah so let's just um, take them on and see what happens here we might be able to actually avoid the donkeys. I don't know if they'll aggro on us as long as we leave them alone. But, uh, okay. Yeah, so that very first little bit there was pretty them and squeezy. Oh, well, never mind. <laughs> I guess we're going to aggro the donkeys. Yeah, that's probably just as well. out here. Looks like we might be a little bit too low for Ghost to attack, but he's still giving Pepper mate boost, so it's still useful for sure. A pretty decent sized melee here. I don't, obviously I don't have a healer with this, so that's a thing. If we get too terribly beat up, we might have to just go for the artifact and not do the whole cave right now, but we'll see how things go. The thing about these caves I've noticed is there's a lot more enemies than it first appears. They kind of like come out of the woodwork almost. Sounds pretty crazy. Okay, so yeah, we still have some more sharks coming in. Um, I'm not even sure where Armosa is. So we'll just kind of keep at it here until the enemy um, chillaxes. Which uh, may be right now, at least for the little guys. Okay. Let's go, um, let's go up a bit. Definitely do not see my Mosa. So we're probably going to have to maybe stage everybody right about here ish. And then I'm going to have to go back to the Mosa. Oh wow, look at all the jellyfish coming. See, that's why we're on a basket sword. <laughs> that is a lot of jellies. Oh my god. Okay, let's kill him. 
I mean, it's nothing for the bass, but still, that would be deadly for uh, other other sea creatures. Oh, another one. Okay. Now, I don't want everybody getting away. If you go off on your own, that's how you're going to get killed. So get your ass back here. Um, okay, yeah, let's, um, let's actually retreat just a little bit. Because if they get too far in there, they are going to just take off and go off on their own. Um, I don't feel like we have everybody with us either, uh, aside from the Mosa, which we definitely don't have with us. So let's go back here. Damn it, now I'm stuck again. There we go. I really wish they'd do something about the lighting in here. And it has something to do with medium settings because I've watched other YouTubers go in these caves and not everybody has this black oily look problem. Uh, but some people do, including me, and I play pretty much on medium settings. So yeah, I don't know what the deal is with that. Um, all right, where the hell is our Mosa? We didn't lose anybody, did we? I didn't notice it. No, we didn't. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Probably just stuck somewhere. Yeah, look at that. We have... Oh, shit. I was going to say, did we just... No. Yeah, see, there's a couple more sharks that were left behind, too. All right, we're stuck again. It's, like, really glitchy right here. Hey, everybody just go down there for a second and stay put. Let me get the Mosa and this other shark unstuck. Proceed. That's just wonderful. Nice pathing, wild card. Okay. Turn around. I think everybody's with us now. So let's get back on Pepper. Turn in this way and have everybody follow. Okay, here we go. Okay, what we're gonna do first is we're gonna surface and then I'm gonna do a head count, make sure we have everybody before we proceed. Okay, I turned the gamma up too, just so we can see a little bit better, because it's super dark in this game. Um, all right, so how about if everybody goes over there? No, we are we're freaking missing like half of our sharks. What the hell? Oh, yeah, there they are, right there. All five of them stuck right in that spot. Can you believe that? The first thing we're going to do is get the first artifact. I'm just trying to look real quick to see if there's any um, uh, loot crates. Uh, but we're going to get the artifact first, so that way we can then go do the rest of the cave and then come back and get another one. Hopefully we can come out of here with you know two or three artifacts. Sometimes there's a loot crate right down there, but I don't see it. Um, okay, let's, uh, 
Let's grab the team and see if we can get them over to the artifact entrance uh, without getting all of them stuck. Where's Pepper at? Pepper, 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 where did you go? Okay, so we want to go, yeah, we want to go this way. Um, in fact, I'm going to take them, I'm going to take them through here. Oh, come on, guys. Seriously. They're all on, like, level 5 follow, and they still get right up in my business. Very irritating. Okay, I'm just looking around to see if we're, if we're going to get an attack. Um, that's a... Oh, okay, there we go. That's a Meg over there. I don't know why it's not coming after us. Like I said, the donkeys don't seem to aggro unless you attack them first, but the makes obviously do. Okay. Okay, let's deal with these guys. Okay. Um, I'm gonna swim right here, and then we go straight down. And yeah, it's going to be lots of fun getting everybody into this hole here. <laughs> Let's just see what happens. Okay. That's better than I was expecting. Okay, let me go get the rest of them, because what we're going to do is we're going to pull... We're going to pull the mobs out of the artifact room back into an ambush. Um, yeah, so that's the plan for that. Uh, did all of the sharks get down here? Just Mosa didn't? Mosa's a pretty big critter to get down here. I don't even know if she'll fit down here. Uh, yeah, she doesn't even fit down here. Okay, that's fine. Um, and what I want you to do is stay here. And you are on neutral, so you can defend yourself. I am going to tell you not to follow whistles, though. And hopefully I'll remember to turn that back off when we get out of here. So she should be fine to just chillax here. And, um, you know, if something does attack her, she, she should be able to, to defend herself, at least theoretically, right? Um, there aren't any really large groups of mobs in here, so I think we'll be okay. I'm surprised all of the sharks got down here on the first attempt. That's a uh, that's impressive. <laughs> that's really impressive. Okay, so um, I want everybody to stop following Pepper. Um, all right, I gotta tell him to move. That's probably not a bad idea to get them a little further in anyway. Okay, so let's go pull the baddies away. Uh, here's a, an eel right here. Um, yeah, hopefully those... I don't want them to aggro and come in here. I want to, like I said, pull the enemies out of here back towards them. Come on, bras. Come at me. Got a little surprise for you. I'm going to show you a new meaning of what it means when you hear Shark Week. <laughs> okay. Everybody go back that way. So this will probably take a few passes, but I think it's going to be a very safe way uh, for us to deal with all the baddies in here. We have, we've got an alpha too, so might as well deal with it right away. Are all y'all coming? Come get me. 
There you go. Come get me, guys. Say hello to my little friends. Looks like we had one shark that chickened out. Or got stuck or something. Uh, I didn't catch the level on this guy. Let's see. Nope, nope, nope. Doesn't work. I'll just bring it back here and let these guys take care of him. Alright, we're thinning them out. It's taking a little while, but that's what it is. I see two more Megs, the Alpha, and then some little guys. Let's just uh, do a little bit of biting on them. Okay. I'm going to stay high. He just came out of the wall. Bring him over all the way over here. Let him kind of bite on me a little bit so I can get him to come through. Alright, did they come through? Okay, good, good, good. Now we're now we're talking. And they're off. Level 190 Alpha Meg. My goodness, that's scary. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. All right. Uh, go back there. I think that takes care of all the big boys. Unless something's stuck in the wall. I don't really care about the little guys. We can chow down on easy enough. Need to get around a little bit here to get this one. There we go. Okay, yeah, I'm not worried about the Eryptids because we have no reason to go down that low. So let's grab the first. Uh, what the hell? Another Corona? Grab the first of these, and then, like I said, we will be back here to nab a couple more. We'll put this one on the uh, otter's inventory. Uh, yeah. What? How come it's not showing the grid lines? That's weird. I don't know. Oh, maybe it has something to do with the the lighting in here or something. I don't know. That's weird. Okay, I'm gonna go... Uh, I'm gonna pull everybody out of this room and then come back down here again. Because uh, chances are another one will spawn. Oh, we have a donkey stuck in the wall. Level 40 is a little, little guy, comparatively. So let's see if we can pull everybody out of here without too much fuss. And they can hang out with Armosa until we're ready to advance in the cave. But yeah, I mean, just to get the artifact. Where, where did those dunks come from? What the hell? You can't do that to me. That's cheating. They might not aggro. Let's just see. I could respawn all the piranhas again, too. Hmm. They don't seem to be aggroing, so... Let's just grab this really quick. 
Okay. Hmm. Maybe this chamber has a fast repop rate. I don't know. That's really weird that they're back there all of a sudden. Okay. Anyway, what I was saying is, yeah, let's let's continue advancing in the cave, and then we will come back to the artifact room again on our way back out and see if we can nab a third one. Okay. So, as I recall, we're going to have a couple, two or three more, you know, water chambers to go through, and there's kind of a choke point, too, that has a lot of enemies, if it's like it was an Ascendant, that is. And I'm not seeing hardly any loot crates in here. Oh, there's one. Okay, good. And then there's also um, a land part, too, that we can get out, you know, just like the other sea cave and do some stuff. Okay, are we clear to hop out for a second and grab this? I think so. Oh. That sucks. I mean, it doesn't suck, but it's not that great. <laughs> okay, so... Um, guess we move through here. Yeah, we gotta go. Well, it looks like there's two passages. Hmm. Everybody with us? It looks like it. I don't remember two passages. Oh, that looks like a. A dead end. It is indeed. Okay. Everybody go back that way. Okay, yeah, here's where we need to go. Now, at some point here, we're going to, again, if it's like... I remember from Evolve, we're going to run into a whole shit ton of enemies here pretty soon. I think. <laughs> um, are we? Yeah, it, we've got to. It's, it's going to happen. Now, there's some eels, but I'm not worried about them. Looks like everybody's with us. For the most part. Where are all the enemies? I think this is the back end of the cave, isn't it? Sure looks like it. That's really odd. Okay. Well, let's surface. Yeah, we are at the we're already at the back end of the cave. And we didn't run into any more water enemies. That is really bizarre. I mean, we're going to have some baddies on land, but This cave is, uh, in terms of just the water enemies, this cave is way easier than the Western Sea Cave. That is just bizarre, man. Okay, well, let's take that off. Um, you know what I didn't do, damn it? I didn't bring a shotgun with me. I just have my laser rifles, which will work, but I would have preferred to use a shotgun on land here. Um... Okay, let's do this. Let's put this artifact in you and go check things out. This looks very familiar uh, to what I, re I remember it to be. And there's usually like bats and spiders and, you know, nasties. There's some bats way over there, I see. Uh, oh, yeah, I see some bats. 
Okay. I do have um, some antidote with me. And I think there's like an explorer note or something up that way. That bat's in the mesh. Yeah, man, there, there used to be a lot more enemies. Even up here. Is this cave broken? <laughs> I mean, seriously, it's like the West Sea Cave has an overspawn issue, or it sure seems like it. And this cave, like, has a fraction of the critters in it that it used to have involved. But it's just so weird. Right, I'm going to kind of stay in the air for the moment. I mean, there are some, like there's some scorpions down there. And a, just a couple of bats here and there, but... It makes it's a little sus, man. I'm not gonna lie. It's a tough scorpion. Yep, two fifty five. Two fifteen bat. Okay, there are two bats over there, but they are definitely in the mesh. There's a spider. But yeah, I mean, those of you who are watching who have played Evolved and have been in this cave, you know there's a hell of there was a hell of a lot more enemies you had to fight through to get through this part, and, and as well as under the water. So I don't know, man. Okay, we got a bat there. Maybe that's part of the problem. Maybe they're just all meshed. Yeah, we just got some scorpions and spiders over there. Killed them. It's a beetle down there. See a couple bats, three bats up that way. All right, let's go over here. I think there's an explorer note up here. There sure as hell ain't any enemies. Hmm. At least I thought there was an explorer note up here. I'm not seeing anything that looks like one. The light certainly changes.
Yeah, see, I thought, thought you'd walk up this little ramp here and find an explorer node up here. I'm not seeing it. Let's um let's get down on the ground here. Kind of funny those bats make a, a little growling noise when you kill them. All right, did we kill that scorp? Right, let's go up and round through here. No explorer note back here, huh? That's really weird. Oh, there it is. Okay. So there is an explorer note back here. What do we got? On Rockwell's recommendation, I've headed south to start an in-depth study of the island's marine life with the help of a tribe called the Painted Sharks. Because the ecosystem of the ocean that surrounds the island is separate from the ecosystem on the mainland, correlating patterns between them might help me isolate and understand this island's scientific abnormalities. Also, after freezing my ass off for so long, I could really use an extended stay on a tropical island. Marine biology was never my strongest field, but I do love the ocean. If nothing else, it should be beautiful there. Level 205, Scorp. <clears throat> okay, so we did find the one explorer note. I like the, the kickback that this rifle has. Oh, does that break rocks? Oh, it does. How interesting. All right, we won't kill the, the dung beetles. Or the snails, no reason to. Let's go this way. Yeah, okay, I remember this little bridge here. And we do have another bat that way. Come at me, bro. Everybody okay down there? Looks like it. Don't see anybody attack them, and if anybody does, they're gonna get wasted. Yeah, I remember having to fight a whole bunch of creatures coming across this bridge. Coming up through here. There's just hardly anybody though, man. Comparatively. Let's go up this way. Nothing up here. I think this looks back off into the the other room with um The artifact. Let's 
tough. See, that's a decent amount of enemies, but even that's not a, really the number that there used to be. I'm going to just pull them off into the water. That's what we used to do. Are they dumb enough to go off into the water? Well, maybe not. Well, that one is. Oh, there they go. <laughs> they were trying to shoot at me. Oh, they did shoot at me. Well, it's a good thing that doesn't pull me down, huh? I'm trying to kill these guys so I can get on the ground. I'm go over there and take a look-see. Takes forever to kill them, though. I just had my shotgun. Well, yeah, 250 scorpion, that's why. Okay, he's dead. I think that takes care of all the scorps. Just having some bats to deal with. No, there's another scorpion over there. I see another bat over here? Yeah, there it is. Yeah, so this looks off over into the room where the artifacts are. Well, there's a decent amount of bats right there. Okay, we got another scorpion to kill here. We can blow him off into the Oh, yeah, we, we can just blow him off into the water. That works too. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the artifact room, and the artifact is right down that way. Okay, well, um, there wasn't typically anything over on these ledges, as I recall. But yeah, this cave is nothing like it used to be in terms of difficulty. I mean, we had our biggest fight right at the entrance there. And and in the artifact room. What's that? It's just a square rock that looks like a, a satchel. All right, well, so much for the mighty eastern sea cave. <laughs> this is kind of a walk in the park compared to the western sea cave. Oh, my goodness. I, I still have to wonder if something's wrong with this cave, though. It just seems very underpopulated, you know? So, I don't know. I'm not sure. Well, we got one explorer note. So, let's go back to the artifact room and grab another one and that room could potentially be fully repopped too so if it is we'll just have to fight it all again but we can do that it's not a problem oh, so it's just hanging out down there okay Looks like we have the majority of them with us. Not really angler fish. Okay. Everybody stay put. I'm gonna backtrack and just make sure we haven't left anybody gotten anybody stuck. Alright, soldiers nine and twelve are completely stuck in the mesh. Um and have been there this whole time. <laughs> Oh, Ark. Seriously? Um, and there's a blue loot crate down there, too, but I don't think I'm going to go after that because we have repops beyond, which we'll have to fight to get back out. I don't know if these donkeys will stay put or not. They probably will. Um, this is such bullshit. Alright, are you guys meshed or... 
Can I mount you? I can't. But that doesn't mean I can get you out. Okay. So, uh-oh. No, don't do this to me, game. Okay. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to... This one will just yeah I don't I don't think I'm gonna risk trying to mount it because I could get stuck myself and I don't care what they had in their inventory well so actually maybe we should try and check this yeah none of that stuff's important yeah I'll take this but the rest of it doesn't matter not really all right we'll have to keep this one in cryo until the sickness thing wears off Okay, let's go back to the crew, uh, get another artifact, and then get the hell out of here. Okay, we have the full crew here, and uh, we're just going to do the same strategy as before. We'll pull the first few out until we get the room reasonably clear. This time, though, I might actually send the whole gang in. I just, I kind of want to bring them all in here because it's kind of jank in here and they'll get stuck and it won't be pretty, you know. Come on, eels. Oh, we pulled quite a few sharks out of there the first on the first run. That's good. Yeah, it was level 50. Okay, I think we I think we can grab this without any issue. Just making sure. All right, let's stick this on uh, the otter, uh, which, by the way, I'm going to give some more health to. I think I'm going to wait for one more. That way we can bring a total of four back with this before we head out. It's weird. As soon as I leave this chamber, it already starts respawning piranhas anyways. Oh, there it is. Nice. Okay, cool. So that gives us a total of four Artifact of the Cunning. That will allow us to do three dragon fights. And still keep one for our trophy room. And of course, we can always come back here and get more later. This cave was, uh, like I said, uh, just a little bit underwhelming, really, to be honest with you. Um, it's nothing. It's not as hard as it was in, a, in Evolved. Uh, but here again, I, I question whether or not it's actually working the way it's supposed to. As as I questioned the Western Sea Cave, in terms of you know overpopulation uh, or uh, overspawn rather, but yeah, there we go. All right, what happened to my uh, oh my Masa source down there, Mosa Masa. Okay, let's put you back on Group Whistle, and we'll do the same for Masa Rita. I'm going to run back over to that little shelf uh, and check for Loot Crate one last time. Uh, there we go. He group whistles. No, I don't see it up there. Okay. Well, we do have that one uh, blue Loot Crate on the way back out. We can check. It's not safe for us to get out yet. 
Well, let's fight first. Black boots, but not as good as what I got. And what is this? A parasaur saddle? In other words, it's grinder material. Yeah, disappointing loot, man. Really disappointing loot. The only two caves that seem to have reliable loot are the ice cave and the swamp cave. Everything else just kind of sucks. It really does. It's too bad. We got a big brawl going on down here. Okay, well, I think that wraps up our, uh, god damn it, Nell Pepper got a lot left behind. I'll go back and get her. Uh, that wraps up this episode, guys, and where are you going? No, 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 stay here. And also our attempt at, well, not our attempt, our successful, um, adventure here in the Eastern Sea Cave. And, um, unless Wild Card changes something or fixes something if indeed something's broken which I kind of suspect it is uh, this cave is really pretty damn easy I mean seriously <laughs> compared to the Western Sea Cave it is a, a really easy run so uh, in the possible event that it is broken and wildcard is going to fix it at some point I would recommend you guys run this cave as much as you can before that happens um, and take advantage of its easiness. Get yourself lots of artifacts of the cunning. Where in the hell did Pepper go? Um, so anyway, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the episode here. And um, most likely I will not have another episode out. There she is. Uh, until I get back from my trip, which will be at the end of January. No videos will be released while I'm gone, of course, because I won't be able to. But uh, when we get back from that trip, we will resume our adventures here in Ark Survival Ascended here on the island. So, with that being said, thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share the video. And we'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.